Good morning, everybody. Still feeling a bit under the weather, but my friend Mike, I've known for, I don't know, close to 10 years now, doesn't know anything about drones. I happen to own a drone, and he's interested in buying one. So today, I'm going to go through the basics, show you guys the truth about owning a drone. And this is a Potemzik drone that I got for $70. It doesn't have a three axis gimbal, which we're gonna go over that. And he had a big question of, how do I even get the footage from the drone out into the sky? We're gonna go over that. So for anybody who doesn't know recently, my grandma fell, took a tumble, and now she's back home. So during the day, I'm kind of watching her. She doesn't like to be watched too much. She goes, I'm an old, I'm a strong old lady, and I'm gonna do what I wanna do. So I just kind of keep an eye on her once in a while. So first off, you never really wanna launch from dirt. You wanna launch from like a nice piece of concrete like this because dirt will get all up in the engines and the rotors. So we're not gonna do that. We are gonna go and launch over here actually. I wish we had some shade because it is feeling very warm out here. Um, but we will be launching from right here, get some good angles and let's go get this drone. So this is everything that you'll get when you receive your drone. You get the actual drone itself. You get a controller. Now if you get a nicer drone, this will be like a screen. But since I don't have a nicer drone, what I have to do is... I take out the controller right here. And by the way, I'm going to recommend a drone for you, Mike, in particular, and for everybody else watching this video. Um, DJI just released a 4K drone that's $299 that I'm going to be buying soon and replacing this drone with um, because it's just so much nicer. The quality is insane. So you plug your phone in right here and there's a little cable that also plugs into your phone. Depending on what phone you have, they give you C cords, they give you lightning cords, they give you everything that you need. So you would just plug your phone in and then turn on this controller and plug it in here. Now my cord's a little scuffed, so I kind of have to put it right there. Now, the drone itself is going to be doing the recording. And this is called a micro SD card. You can get them at Walmart, you can get them at Target, Amazon, anywhere. And it just goes into this little part right here. So you just stick your micro SD card in. Make sure it's in there nice and good. And you're going to want to put in your battery. And that's all you have to do, really. Your drone is set up. I'm going to turn it on. And on my phone here, you're going to see that I have an app called Potensic Pro. So let's go ahead and put our drone down here. just like this and you're gonna see now I can enter the device and so that's what the drone that's what the drone is seeing right here so there's a little thing right here that says take a picture you could take a picture or you could record video I'm gonna record the whole video starting now and let's take off and let's get some footage So here is the drone. This is the Potemzik Atom SE. Now it doesn't have a three axis gimbal. And what that means is the recording itself is gonna be very shaky, which is why I recommend the new DJI Mini 4K. For only $300, you get insane quality. So let's go ahead and get some views. Let's go check out what these construction workers are doing. Um, now there are two things you need to know when flying a drone. Number one, a drone has to be under 250 grams, right? So this drone is 249. Every little drone is under 249. Because larger than that, you're gonna need a license. And the only thing you have to do is, you have to go online and you have to take a test. It's from the FAA and the test is called the trust test. It's free, um, you don't have to pay for it. You go online and it's from the FAA and you just answer a bunch of questions. It's real simple. 
and it just shows you the rules and everything what you're supposed to do right you can't fly higher than you know 400 feet um, proper airspace right so it just teaches you all of that stuff and um, I don't think I'm gonna be able to get this back because I'm not sure what tree or where it is exactly and you know what I'm kind of okay with that I was really really looking for a new reason to upgrade anyway so this is what we're gonna do we are gonna go into the settings get the SD card, we're gonna format it. After formatting the files on the SD card will be permanently deleted. Formatted successful, let's just do it again just in case, don't need anybody finding it and seeing where I live or any of my personal videos. SD card deleted. Well, And there you have it, Mike. So normally you would drop, ah, <laughs> oh, forget it, man. I will do a new drone video when I buy the DJI Mini 4K. Um, that is not how I expected the day to go. I would, did not expect to crash at my drone. Um, I had it for a while. I had it for, I don't know, six or seven months. Did I get my $70 worth out of it? Absolutely. I hated it. I didn't like using it in videos. The quality was just so bad and so crap. Yeah, the drone is now disconnected. Um, so yeah, now I do not have a drone anymore. So I mean, that was relatively interesting. Oh man, what a day. So obviously there's not gonna be any drone footage in this video. And that is a, I don't know, it's kind of sad because I really did like the good old Potenzig drone. Um, but like I said, man, the video quality wasn't there. If you're gonna get a drone, you gotta get a DJI. So Mike, I will definitely be making a video on the DJI and we can go through the whole thing together. I don't know when I'll buy it. I think I'll probably buy it in the next two weeks or something. But um, yeah, say goodbye to the old Potems that crashed in a tree and I have no idea where that tree is. It won't show me the GPS location or anything. And even if it did, I'm not going to climb a palm tree and go get it in somebody's yard. I don't know. It's just not worth it. It's 70 bucks. That was fate. That was time for an upgrade. I got to go do a final right now. It is my international relations final, so I am going to go do that. And, uh... Yeah, guys. Thanks for watching. Definitely uh, hit me with a like if you enjoyed me watching me lose my drone. Sorry, Mike. I thought that video would go a bit better, man. <laughs> oh, well. Subscribe if you subscribed it and like if you liked it. Peace! And Buckreeves.